Welcome to the Black Human Infrastructure channel. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Help us so we can grow. Leave a comment. Tell a friend. Be a friend. But enough of that. Eminem is not the greatest rapper. And I'm going to need pick-me black folks like Ed Lover and MC Shane to stop telling that lie. Besides, most of what he rapped about is often his baby mama in some horrendous and disturbing ways. So I get why these new niggas that hate women, especially black women, would glorify him. Now, does Eminem know how to string together words and wordplay? Sure, but the greatest? Absolutely not. I grabbed a comment from a poster uh, that goes by the name Hexter Set, and it reads, I don't care what these hired slave coons think. You can't be the greatest of anything in someone else's culture. You just can't, because it's not your culture, especially when you appropriated the culture or that culture. Just like I can't go to Latin America and become the, the goat of Latin music or the goat of Hindu music or Arab music. A white can never be the goat of a black American cultural art form. The end. And I agree, 100. Per Wikipedia, rap is an artistic form of vocal delivery an emotive expression that incorporates rhyme, rhythmic speech, and common street vernacular. It is usually performed over a backing beat or musical accompaniment. The components of rap include content, what is being said, example lyrics, flow, rhythm, rhyme, and delivery, cadence, tone. Rap differs from spoken word poetry in that it is usually performed off time to musical accompaniment. It also differs from singing, which varies in pitch and does not always include words. Because they do not rely on pitch inflection, some rap artists may play with timber or other vocal qualities. But rap is primary. Rap is primary ingredient of hip hop music and so commonly associated with the genre that is sometimes called rap music. The roots and origin. Similarities to rapping can be observed in West African chanting folklore traditions. Centuries before hip hop music existed, the griots of West Africa were delivering story rhythmically over drums and sparse instrumental instrumentation. Such resemblance has been noted by many modern artists, modern day griots, spoken word artists, mainstream news source, and academics. Rap lyrics and music are part of the black rhetorical continuum, continuing past traditions of expanding upon them through creative use of language and rhetorical styles and strategies. Now, who created rap? One of the first rappers at the beginning of the hip hop period, at the end of the 1970s, was also hip hop first DJ, DJ Cool Herc. Herc, a Jamaican immigrant, started delivering sample raps at his parties. Also credited DJ Hollywood, as another innovator of rap music. Per another insightful commentator, <clears throat> the Negro is a dual-minded phenomenon. We know these people are our enemies, but we have grown up watching movies that, that say they're our friends and lovers. And our, mu and our music F you to people who look like you. Situations like this remind us that the programming is real. And I 100% once again agree. So my question is,
to black people. Why are so many black people quick to give away everything synonymous with their race and culture? Especially to folks that continue to steal everything from us and profit from it and then pretend they are the ones that came up with the idea, style and culture. But as always, to their core, they never give props or respect to the very people they took it from to begin with. I detest black people like Ed Lover, a paid plant. Black men, what is the obsession most of you have that make you so desperate for white men's acceptance and approval? Turn off the switch and deprogram your mind. Like seriously, black people, I, I, I don't get it. You already gave away country music, rock music jazz, the blues, and the list goes on. And now you're ready to give away rap? Rap that originated as a cry for respect to treat a person with dignity, to treat black people with dignity. For law enforcement to remember the oath that they took, that folks are innocent until proven guilty and not guilty on sight because they're black? Rap came out of struggles and pain and literally to be treated humanely. And you new paid coons and dusties that are not being paid but are so desperate pygmies, you're so quick to give it to a white man that will never be treated the way you are in society that was built for him not you. When will enough of us get it? Like, like seriously, when will enough of us get it and wake up and start loving your own community the way you so desperately love the other community?